Hello and welcome. If you have the curiosity to know what artificial intelligence is anyway, what it entails, then I have a very simple definition for you. I have created a formula version of AI definition, which is that AI is equal to knowledge systems plus arithmetic and logical capabilities, computing and communication skills, plus artificial neurons, plus digital brain power, plus vast amount of data, plus extensive libraries of books and information, plus billions of words that we use, plus multiple languages that we speak, plus creative dimensions, plus foundational work and applications of innovations and inventions. So from this formula, we will now move to the descriptive understanding of AI and let us talk about comprehensive framework of artificial intelligence. So this is not just a formula. This summative definition of AI that we just studied is a comprehensive framework that represents the multifaceted nature of artificial intelligence. Each element that we included in this definition plays a vital role in equipping these machines, system and chatbots with the intelligence. And the thing is that if you want to understand artificial intelligence, we can also treat it more like a digital mind, right? Artificial intelligence is now an intricate orchestration of knowledge systems that integrate arithmetic and logical capabilities that are refined through advanced computing and communication skills. It incorporates artificial neurons because they have neuron networks now that emulate the machines with the capabilities that are more like human capabilities and they have immense power of digital processing now, right? So artificial intelligence, uh, in short is a digital mind you can view it as a digital mind the next dimension of artificial intelligence is data data is the heart beat of artificial intelligence it is the lifeblood of artificial intelligence it is the vast accumulation of diverse data sets huge number of books extensive libraries billions of words, multiple languages, all these have been used to train these uh, uh, systems which are now called machine learning systems. So these machines, these systems, these chatbots, they are trained, they learned from vast pool of data. So that is why we say that data is heartbeat of intelligence artificial intelligence and now the AI systems are on the journey and the journey is that they transform the data into wisdom guiding AI from a wealth of information to a path of deep knowledge now so there is a deep learning happening now right this deep learning does what this deep learning gives them the power which is moving from not only the computational power but to the power which is a creative power right this is the evolving landscape of ai right beyond this sheer computational power we see that machines are very fast now the AI is extending into the realms of creativity, fostering innovation and invention that 
continually pushes the limits of what machines can do and achieve. This is done through what they call technically supervised and unsupervised learning, where systems are not only trained, but continuously refined to perform the tasks with increased sophistication and autonomy. Autonomy. Machines are becoming autonomy. They are learning to make decisions themselves. They are learning to identify the patterns which human mind cannot identify sometimes. So that is now happening in AI that AI has the creative power, the power of creation. This is summative definition of AI that I made and we started with that. There is a caution and hope as well. The caution is that we need to persuade the AI researcher, right? When I say AI researcher, I mean these big tech companies. They should work to direct it. They should work to use it in such a way that artificial intelligence collaborates harmoniously with human intelligence and does not make human intelligence redundant as more and more people are fearing the loss of job and employment these days because of AI tools, right? So the hope is that artificial intelligence would emulate and enhance human intelligence. And this is the hope that it won't make the human intelligence redundant Rather, we will work together and there will be a fusion of our accumulated knowledge, our computational powers and our inventive ambitions uh, with that of uh, this fusion will happen with that of AI and we will learn, we will adapt and we will innovate together with AI human intelligence would, would uh, work together with AI and uh, we will find solutions to our problems. Uh, we will find solution to things like uh, cancer uh, treatment and all those things uh, which need to be invented, which need to be discovered and uh, for the betterment of humanity. Thanks for joining. See you next time.